One of the big challenges in life science today is to drive research projects that integrates new data with all the data that's been collected by other scientists across the world. And we actually have the opportunity of doing that. None of this will work without highly qualified people and we run an extensive training program for that. There aren't enough bioinformaticians around with these skills. We don't have the scientific depth to cover all the areas where bioinformatics will go over the next decades. And that's why Elixir is just so critical for us, for Europe and for the world to deliver bioinformatics to the entire planet. The biologists nowadays, they have a little bit of programming. They have that already in their curriculum. But sometimes it's not enough to really be able to use the resources. We have three main target publics. One is the user the user of the resources of the nodes in Elixir. The other target public is the, the trainers. So we have the Train the Trainers project to improve the number of trainers. And the developers that we call are the people that are implementing the infrastructure. TES is our project for the training in Elixir. It is our training platform that we call. It's the web portal where you can buy, anyone can go, like the users, the trainers. They can learn by themselves with the workflows. They can also find all the information about the events of training that we are going to have. So training is critical. It's not just training that's delivered in training courses, but you know the exchange programs that we have where we would send a developer to sit with somebody, say, in Finland or in Slovenia to work with that person and to really understand what their problems are and to see if we can build a collaborative solution. There are a lot of groups working on a lot of diverse subjects and finding that right expertise at the right time is, is complicated. At least through the Elixir infrastructure, we can find the data and then find the people that generated that data. I was 20 years younger. I would go into data science, bioinformatics and computational biology because you got enough data for playing around. And you might be involved actually in new development of diagnostic or new development of ways of treating patients. The big success of training would be that we have skilled users having the right questions in biology and being confident on the results that they have. And they know that the infrastructure is something that Elixir is going to take care of that for them and they can concentrate on the real biological question.